Hello and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to show you how to create countdown timers in Canva. Now this is some of it is free and then I will also show you some paid portions in Canva to create these countdown timers. So let's go ahead and get started. So if you haven't already created your Canva free account for teachers, you want to go ahead and do that. If you are not a teacher, go ahead and create your free account and some of this you can do as well. So this is your main screen. You want to go to video and then you want to choose the size video that you want to use. So this first one is 1920 by 1080 pixels. That's the one I'm going to choose. Notice when you choose the size from the video tab, you will have a video play button up here. So now all we have to do is choose our background. Choose whatever background you would like. And then you can add numbers. You can change the color of the number if you'd like. Down here at the bottom, you want to click on the slide and you will be given this option to duplicate this slide and we're going to just change the number now. Click on the slide, duplicate, and again change the number. That's one option for numbers. If you don't want to have plain numbers and you want to add a little more animation, we can do that as well. And I'll show you that in just a moment. Now that I have all my numbers set up, I want to click on the timer and let's do 1.5 seconds for each of these slides. So if you want to change the numbers, all you have to do is let's go ahead and go into elements and instead of backgrounds, let's look for animated numbers. I need five. Where's the five? There it is. And because we already have these slides set up with our timers, all I have to do, and look at it, recommends it, so all I have to do is add the next number, which is four. Notice when we play this one, now it has the animated numbers. This was all free in Canva, and then you would just download it as an MP4 video, and you can use this. So I went to my elements, and I chose beach, and I clicked on this one. It is free, but with your paid teacher account, you can use the ones that are not free as well. We go to video and we want to get a countdown timer. Choose the one with the amount of time that you want. So here you have another timer. Another thing you can do with Canva is you can add music right here. Go to audio. This is free for educators. You want to just make sure you are checking the copyright on this and what's required. Do you have to pay for anything? And the way you check that is right here, these three dots and it will come up free for Canva education and it will give you all the licensing information. So I'm gonna go ahead and add this. And now when I play my timer, now you have the music playing in the background. And all you do is download it as your MP4. Another option I wanted to show you if you just go here and you go to videos and you type in countdown timer, some of these are already built in and they're fully animated.
and you don't even have to build them. They're already ready to go. So also, in the event that your music is too loud, you can come up here, click on the music, and you can go to the speaker and you can actually adjust the volume because at 100% it is a little bit loud. You can also drag this and choose what part of the song you wanted to play at. What I also like to add is a stop screen. So go to add another slide and then you can either go to videos and type in stop sign, whatever it is that you want, add that. So now when you play your slide, this is what's gonna happen. Hope you found this video helpful. For more tips on Canva, go ahead and check out these two videos here. Remember, step out, be uniquely wonderful you, and have a great day.